was largely paid for, but there were a few incidents. Our correspondent in Abuja is Virgo King. There have been incidents around the country. In the northeast, Islamic militants tried to attack the city of Maiduguri. To the south, in River State, voting in one area had to be postponed after shots were fired at a polling station. And there were also complaints about voting machines breaking down. The car reader is not working. It's going to three hours now, we'll be waiting now, and the time is going. But overall, the picture was of relative stability. The harder question is whether this election will change the culture of terrorism and corruption that disfigures public life in this country. India's Prime Minister Narendra Modi has condemned recent attacks on Kashmiris living in different parts of the country. The attacks followed a deadly bombing in Indian-administered Kashmir just over a week ago. Narish Koshik reports. Addressing a public meeting in Rajasthan, Mr. Modi said assaults on Kashmiris only play into the hands of terrorists. His comment came after India's Supreme Court asked the government to prevent such violence. In recent days, widespread anger at a suicide bombing in Kashmir led to the harassment and beatings of Kashmiri students and businessmen in different parts of India.